guys and welcome back to the happy heart i am so glad that you guys came over today to see this dollar tree haul so let me tell you i had to rush and go to the dollar tree me and my husband actually went on a date while our son was out to the movies with some of our friends and the dollar tree just happened to be there i needed a few things and so i said can we run over there really really fast and so i ran in and about 28 dollars later i will show you my haul so does that not happen to anyone else? You just need like a couple things and then, I don't know, $20, $30 later, it's ridiculous. But I'm really glad that I got all the little things I needed so I can just stop thinking about it and I have some stuff coming up that I really um, just needed a bunch of little things for. So I will get to it and show you guys my haul. If you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and those bell notifications. I would love to have you a part of my YouTube family. I am a lifestyle YouTuber, so I definitely do stuff that is relevant to my everyday life, relevant to my family. So I do everything from cleaning, organizing, decluttering, to shopping, hauls, um, anything and everything you could think of. So if that sounds like something you're into, go ahead and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all, so this is my haul. Oh, it does not look super impressive, actually. I kind of tried to show you guys things that were like grouped together so we can go ahead and start over here um this is the only off the wall thing it's these um multi-surface wipes oh my gosh they're in different packaging but i love these things i thought they actually stopped selling them they are awesome and they do all these different surfaces so as you can see they do tile and wood and granite marble stainless steel glass um, so you can use them basically for everything the only thing I don't, I don't like is the stainless steel part of it. Um, I don't really use them for that, but I don't, um, but they work really, really well. They're like the best thing if you hate dusting. Oh my gosh. And so this is the new packaging. I saw them over by the actual um, cleaning products, like all of the multi-surface cleaners and things like that. And they were just kind of hanging up over there. So I grabbed those. I grabbed two things of eggs because for some reason I don't have any and I wanted to make sure we had our Easter egg hunt this year um, just at my house. So I got these little um, small candies to put inside the eggs and then I think I'm actually going to put like some change and a couple of dollar bills and things like that. I didn't want to go like too candy wise with it. but. I really did want to have some kind of a hunt. To go along with the Easter stuff, I actually got some grass for my son's Easter basket. And I got this grass, which is actually for this. I want to make some kind of a nest in here. And I thought that this could work. Um, and then I would put some Easter eggs in there. So stay tuned for that. And if I have a link to either the Easter basket that I made this year for him or... Um, this decorating I will put them here so this stuff was all for his birthday um, my son's birthday is coming up and I always decorate either the dining room the living room I don't know I always decorate somewhere for his birthday so when he wakes up birthday morning something's decorated I always go in and put streamers like around his bed so that's why I got streamers I do it at Christmas time too I have no idea why I just think it's fun um, or I'll hang them from his door and then I always blow up a bunch of balloons and I a lot of times I'll put them in his room so like he wakes up and can't walk there's so many balloons or um, I'll put them like last year I put them all over my living room and I kind of decorated my fireplace and I always get these two-in-one banners so you can tell so it comes with two um, just to have they're the same price so might as well and this one is like kind of shimmery so I think that will be actually really fun this is the weirdest thing I got, let me tell you. So it's this plastic balloon pump, but I thought this might work. We'll see. I don't know. Um, as you can tell, this is what, uh, you know, a lot of balloons. It's over three dozen balloons. And so we usually do somewhere around like 40 something balloons. And every year it is tiring. So that is my little splurge. We'll see for a dollar if it works or not. 
Over here, um, we have a little bit of Easter and birthday kind of combined. I got some tissue paper for um, gifts because I got some gift bags that you'll see in just a second. This was all the rest of the stuff I wanted to get for his Easter basket. And, um, and so this was just, I already had actually a lot of stuff for his Easter basket. And I really just went for candy and then I got a few other things because, you know, you always have to have some kind of a chocolate bunny, right? My kid loves Snickers, so I got him a few Snickers. And Kit Kats are his favorite lately, so I got him Kit Kats. And he tried Nerds for the first time, so that's why I did get these. And he liked them. And so I thought that would be actually really fun. Um, and I thought he would like this little egg thing. These I thought were really cute. It's like the cutouts and different things for Play-Doh. And my son, we were at our church yard sale, and somebody gave him a bunch, like a whole box of brand new Play-Doh that had never been played with. And, oh my gosh, he's just been loving it. So I thought this would be really fun to put in his um, Easter basket because he actually saved up his allowance and bought something else, like a kit of some kind to play with Play-Doh. And, oh my goodness, it was nowhere, it was way more expensive than a dollar. I thought this was actually hilarious. I just wanted to grab a whoopee cushion because I thought he would think that's funny. And when we were at the beach last week, he actually forgot his sunglasses in Cracker Barrel. So I got random some random sunglasses. I really didn't know which ones he would like. And for a dollar, I just got both pairs. I was like, okay, I'm not gonna stand here all day. So we'll see. I actually think these will look really cute on him. And last but not least, I got um, a couple gift bags for his birthday. Of course, we gotta have some superheroes here. So Avengers, which I thought was actually pretty cool. Um, Minions, this was the first one I picked out, but I thought it was really cute. And the only other boy one they had was the Spider-Man one. Venom was kind of crazy, but I think that he'll think this is awesome. So those were the only boy ones he had. And I knew for sure that I was gonna need two gift bags. And then I didn't know about his other grandparents, how they were sending something. So I wanted to make sure that I got a extra one just in case. I do have like a stash of bags, but um, I did just want to get some in case that I knew were the right size. So this is my Dollar Tree haul. It is Eastern birthday basically. Thank you guys so much for coming over for checking out this haul let me know what is the what do you go to Dollar Tree for what is your like most purchased item from Dollar Tree because I'm always curious I usually go there for either like cleaning products or gift wrap most of the time but I love um, getting like streamers and things like that from there as well so let me know what is the thing that you buy from Dollar Tree because I know everybody has that one thing that they always go to Dollar Tree for. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and getting to the end of this video. If you liked it, go ahead and get that, hit that thumbs up button. And I will see you guys in the next brand new video. And I hope in the next video my voice will sound normal. You guys, I'm trying to get on the mend. So cross your fingers that I can um, just get this cough under control. So... I will see you guys in my next brand new video. Bye for now.